approaching the midway point of the group stage. I'm John Champion, Jim Beglin's alongside me. And here we have Bayern Munich against Olympiakos. Anything you want to comment on before we start, Jim? Well, I'm sure the two sets of players will respond to our expectations, but the key point today may well be taking those chances. And we're now all set. Now Jerome Boateng. Here's Tony Cruz. La. It's on for him. Ball stolen, flicks it over the top, a chance! No, that's not going to make it. Got it. Now Fetfetsidis. Fifteen minutes gone in the first half. Ribéry, he plays it through. Torresidis, here's Fetfetsidis. Cut out in a promising position. A lunge! No luck there! Well, that may just be the tonic they needed, because it's taken until now to get something in at goal. You know, it has to be a source of encouragement for them. Some slick passing on display. What can they make of it? And Robin. Thirty minutes played. Torresidis. Javi Martinez. Slides it through. Now Robin. It's the ball, he scores! It's one goal to nil. He benefited from a slide rule pass. Oh, the through ball there was an absolute peach. He was early and accurate, he didn't even have to break stride. They get us underway at 1-0. Well, when you look around the dressing room and think, who can I depend on? This is the guy for me. He's such a wonderful technician. Plays this forward. Great chance for the counter. Now through to Javi Martinez. 
couldn't make the most of the chance. Well, that's the kind of break that can do a lot of damage. It just lacked the finish to be a great counter-attack and strike. It was so direct. Here's Jerome Boateng. Now Tony Cruz. Lam, Robin, whose goal-scoring skills have already been seen. Sends it to the middle, and he's there to clear it. Oh, that's a vital block. And there is the referee's whistle to end the first half. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Just the one goal separates them then. It's 1-0. Bayern Munich against Olympiakos. Potteridis. Ribéry. Betfatsidis. Wants to get this forward. No, it was cut out. Schweinsteiger. He played for an hour now. Müller. This is very pleasing on the eye. Can he now find a finish? Shoots, puts it away. It's a comfortable lead now, two goals. Do you put that down to good finishing or to poor defending? I think it's hard to keep a good man down and with this fella's instinct for position, he's always going to score goals like that. So, it's now 2 without reply. Well, at 1-0, this game was very much in the balance, but at 2-0, they ought to be able to defend this lead from here. No, it's been cut out. Betfatsidis chipped through over the top. Now the chance, and it's a really well-taken goal. So, down to just one now, can they find an equaliser? It stemmed from losing the ball in a really dangerous position. Well, you know, that's what usually happens in football. When one team is careless, the other is only too willing to capitalise. Ouch. difference is down to one well it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline this game plan could near well reward them with an equalizer Javi Martinez Tony Cruz now through to Tony Cruz it's on for him there's a real confidence about them and they look as though fitness levels and energy are still strong but they have to maintain possession they can't afford to lose it again If the support had come quicker, that wouldn't have broken down. It wasn't the best of passes, really. Schweinsteiger. Now Javi Martinez. Tried to play it through. Opportunity for a goal. It's in. That should do it. It really is the ideal time to strike. That goal just shows you the real quality in this team. Yeah, this is a lovely brand of football we're watching. They're playing with flair and enterprise, and there's a real cutting edge to their attack. A brace of goals for him now.
surely now this match is over as a contest. Well, that's a really bitter blow. I think it's going to be very hard for them to find the character to respond from that. Ball in. Up to Noddit. Another goal. They've most definitely hit their stride now. People will admire the header, but really, it's the cross that deserves the praise. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. And it's the substitute who scored. I bet the manager feels pretty good now. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been, go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. And there is the final whistle. The whole gamut of attacking play was on display here, tearing through the defence almost at will. And all that remains is for me to thank my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, as our live coverage comes to a close this evening.